Hello boys and girls, my name is Fred Lucario, and welcome to Prison Architect. Now, we're going to go through a short tutorial. Or short recommendations. So you want to have a large prison if you're... If you're going to hold... If you want to, like... Have a bunch of inmates... I suggest you turn gangs off if you if you have failure conditions on. You can have events which are extra challenges, but I'm not gonna get to that point yet. Weather and temperature, we'll get to that later. Which adds changing weather and varying temperatures, which means you have to think about heating. I suggest you turn on unlimited funds. Generate, generate for. I don't recommend you do generate forests unless you like want to cut down a bunch of. Unless you want to have your con construction workers or workmen cut down a bunch of trees, which will take probably like minutes or even hours. <laughs> I don't recommend you choose fog of war and lakes. I don't really sh think you should choose that. I don't know what generate buildings do. So let's go. I suggest you like start out with a holding cell. Don't forget to put beds, a bench, some toilets, and and some telephones, some TVs, and and some weight benches in the holding cell. Keep your keep to to like you know to like you know have you your inmates needs have some of your inmates needs taken care of. I want to add a bunch of telephones. I want to add telephones and, and a few TVs. Let's just add four TVs. With unlimited funds, you can build as much as you want without having to worry about money.
this isn't required, but, and I don't really recommend this, but, I might want to do this, just in case. I'm gonna have to, I want to build a reception. The guards will search the prisoners. If you want to do like a quick, if you want your guards to search around the prison quick, click on shakedown. Every building you, you you make your construction work so I like to call them construction workers, but your workmen. I recommend you also give them like a storage room. Like build a huge storage room. But it's up to you. You need to build a canteen if you if you want your prisoners, it's one of it's one of your prisoners' needs. Thank God this is a game, and not real life. You might want to add enough. You might want to add some tables. Like I'd say about six, but I'm going to do like ten tables. You know what, I'm just gonna go for eight. Ah, uh, ten. You might also wanna... You need... Can... I can... The canteen... The canteens need... Uh, I hate it when it does that. Anyways, ignore what just popped up. And let's continue. You might want to add some telephones. Yeah, I'm using my blue computer because my black computer is broken and I accidentally downloaded some things that I shouldn't have. Retarded me. And don't take the retarded part too seriously. In places like the canteen, you need to add some radios. You don't have to, but you might want to.
I might want to speed up. I want to do maximum speed. And if you want to make this go faster. If you want your prisoners to have food, if you want food, if you want your prisoners to have food in the canteen, build a power station. Build a, build a power station and a water pump station. And have water and connect water. You might want to connect water pipes to things such as toilets. I suggest you use small pipes and holding cells and cells and dormitories. Dormitories are sh shared cells. Well, in this game. We're gonna hire more workmen. The more workmen you make, the more successful. The more faster your prison will be successfully built. And you might want to hire, you might want to hire them in storage, cause they're completely idiotic. And workmen and construction workers in real life, not so idiotic. You don't want to sack any of your construction workers unless they're like trapped. That's why you have to like have doors. You know, you can build yourselves with regular doors, jail doors, or large jail doors. It's up to you though. I usually. Since our prison, our prison kitchen is gonna be. I'm gonna be like that.
This is a canteen. I don't recommend you use quick fill, or else you'll be taking up you'll be taking up a lot of space. I also recommend it because we get the job done quicker. You like building cells or building offices or solitaries or luxury cells or shared cells. You can also clone, which I don't recommend you use the clone tool, it's pretty crappy. At a reception. I want to add enough sprinklers to the kitchen and hire a lot of cooks. Oh yeah, you also have to label them. Since our holding cell is built, let's label it. Let's label it as a holding cell. Let's go to a large yard. What I mean by large is large. Like I said before, you can you can add you can add doors anywhere. You might want to add things to the yard that you build. To keep the to help keep the rioters from ah not rioters but prisoners from rioting. <laughs> 